After searching round the farm, they eventually found the ducklings. But unfortunately, the cat, Della, had got there first. I ended up catching the cat with a duck in her mouth at this stage. And um, it really looked, Ronan was like, she's going to kill the duck. I was thinking, oh no. Yeah. We're only after getting them back, and now she's going to eat them right in front of us. Then, Emma noticed something unusual. I was like, Ronan, she's not actually forcefully holding this duck. That's when the amazing thing happened. We put the, the cat down, uh, put the ducklings down, and then all of a sudden the three little ducklings waddled straight underneath the cat. The cat lay down on her side, put her paw o over one of the little ducklings and was kind of nursing the duckling in towards us. So we were, I mean, just absolutely mm. blown away with this. Because normally cats would eat little small birds, but it was, it, was, it, was just, it was awesome. It was just incredible to see it. She was um, very content at this stage. She was purring and she was really loving towards the ducklings. When I was petting her down, um, I noticed that she actually had given birth to three kittens only within an hour or so beforehand. It was a very lucky coincidence for the ducklings that the cat found them just after giving birth herself. For a narrow window of a couple of hours, mothering hormones will have been coursing through her body causing her to love and nurture any small, warm, furry creature she found next to her. I have no doubt whatsoever that the cat was thinking dinner. If she had seen them either maybe a couple of hours before or a couple of hours after, I have no doubt that she would have put the napkin around her neck, knife and fork, salt and pepper, the whole lot.